what's up guys welcome to the video and today i'm going to teach you how to do something like this as you can see we have this situation going on i can draw whatever i want here like hello right and we have like this effect of like embossed i don't know how to pronounce it but you get the idea right you're watching it it, it kind of looks like water too so you can that would be cool and also we can do it on top of like some type of texture that we want like wood for example and yeah you can give this this effect it's really cool and it's really simple to do so i'm gonna get right into it right now so the first thing that we have to do is we're just gonna pick the the brush tool you know like the normal brush like this and select really whatever color that you want it doesn't really matter the color because we're not gonna see the color anymore so you can pick like red if you want i'm gonna draw here like a like a smiley face right something cool like this hi there you go so now once we have well we can do this before or after it's, it's preferably you you just draw the thing first so you can see it properly and then you can go here <clears throat> where the layers are on top of here you can see this thing that says fill here you have the opacity the layer style right and down here you have the fill option so you want to have this at zero percent you know you put that at zero percent so now you might be thinking oh it disappeared yeah exactly that's what we want to happen we don't want to see the the lines we just want to see like the the texture let's say so now we have okay so if you don't know how i open this you just go to the layer that your drawing is in you double click the layer and this window is going to open up so just go here to the first one that says bevel and emboss I don't know how to pronounce that but i i hope i'm saying it right and now as you can see here we have this this thing now what would you what you want to do now is like you just want to play around with this you know just play around with these numbers see what what looks better we can do it like this we can make it like sharper or more soft we're gonna make it like this, bigger or smaller. And yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Now you can also play with these things. So you have different styles, right? So you have like this style that looks like this, and you have this one. You have inner bevel, whatever that means. You have outer bevel. So yeah, it's really interesting. I like this one, it looks cool. So I'm gonna leave it here. So yeah, it's really interesting what you can do with it. You can also play with these other values. If you actually like activate it here. I don't know what this is. But yeah, just play around with it, see what looks better. You don't necessarily have to understand what's going on. Just yeah, just play around until you find something cool. Here you also have like textures and stuff like that. So play around with it as well if you want to. Yeah, I don't like this one. So I'm just going to leave it like this. Right. And the cool part about all this situation is that once you have this layer style, you can pick the brush again and you can draw whatever you want right so we could just erase this whole thing and we can just get rid of this thing and it wouldn't matter because we can come in and keep drawing with the same style because the style is in the layer right so we have this layer that we're drawing in this layer has the style here you can see it we can yeah exactly <laughs> water so yep that's the whole tutorial oh yeah so here we also have the the wood i brought this image from google so you can see like the different things that you can do 
interesting, right? So you have this. Actually, we could do something like this also with letters if you want to. I'm gonna write my my channel name here in the wood. It's gonna look really cool. All right, let's go. You. So I'm just gonna copy this layer style, copy layer style, paste layer style. And there you go. I have like the the name of my channel in the embossed in wood if that's how you say it i don't know but yeah as you can see you can do a lot of different things with it you can also save the layer style for future projects so you can you can just go here we have this little thing with fx and you save it here like this that's it so now you can use this layer style on, on whatever you want for example, here I have these letters that were for another tutorial. If I just click here, they're going to turn into, into what I just did, right? So yeah, I hope this tutorial was really helpful. I thought you, I hope you learned something. And remember that in my channel, I have tons of tutorials like this for free. So go subscribe so you can keep learning about Photoshop. I also have flash tutorials so if you want to learn about flash also you can go there and yeah thank you for watching i hope you learned